Hey there guys, Black Panther here and welcome back to the crew once again. Today, we're driving the new DLC. This is the Corvette Stingray. Oh yes, this thing is looking monstrous. And it's stock. This is full stock. I haven't gone to the tuner yet. So let's just hurry up and get over there. Oh. I'm excited to see this because I haven't seen a new car in the crew in quite some time. So it's going to be awesome to just see like what parts they've added to this. I saw the carbon bonnet and the spoiler like from the front. Oh, it looked amazing. So hopefully they've got more options as well. So let's go straight to level 40 because we want this thing to go as fast as possible. And we're going to be using it in PvP. Not today, but we will. Oh, just slight changes, but that looks so cool. Come on, hurry up, go back. I want to see it again. Show me. Oh, look at the little panels that have been added. That looks so cool. All right, let's get customizing. Front bumper is where we shall begin. Oh my, okay, that, that is freaking awesome. Let's put that on because those lights are different, but... I'm not sure, like, that looks pretty cool, but, oh, it's like it's been, you know, taped shut because it's a mentalist, probably what it is. You know what? As much as I like those ones, I think what we'll do is we'll go with this one, rear bumper. It needs a bit of stuff at the bottom. It doesn't look right like that. That looks terrifying. I like it. Uh, moving on to the next one. Yeah, I, I want it so it's like, there, like, oh my god. Side skirt, what option? No! What do you think, what do you take me for? Rear wings, come on, give me. Wait a second. Wait, wait a second. That looks fucking awesome. Just for comparison, that's the stock one. It looks bald now, doesn't it? So yeah, we'll go with the other wing. That's like the first time I've put a wing like that on a muscle car. But oh. That looks awesome. And then the hood. Come on, give me some nice hoods. I'm expecting... Okay, we're going with carbon. That's for sure. What's that like? Let me see the front of the car. We're going with number four. Number four. That's the world. Colors. Oh, this is going to be the most difficult bloody thing ever. I love the yellow it comes in, but blue I know is going to look cool. Oh, that blue's even better. You know what? We're going with yellow. It just It's just that car. And now it's time for the rims. Do we have official rims here? Yes, we do. Oh, we got black ones. We got black ones. Yes, we do. Put them on. Oh, yes. Those just are. Oh, that's amazing. I don't really want to put a lot of like visually stuffs on there. Like nothing too over the top. So I think that is pretty simplistic and looks very good. I would prefer it to be a bit longer, but I think that's very simplistic and suits the car very well. But whatever, we're done. Let's go drive it. <laughs> now, you guys heard this thing when it was full stock for a little tiny bit, right? Surely. Well, this is completely different. This is freaking cool. Oh, my God. Look at it. So, for those that don't know, uh, this car is actually included in the season pass, which is absolutely awesome of them to do that. But if you don't want to get the season pass and you just want this one car, you can get it with crew credit. So it's kind of like GTA, except for the fact you can't get it for in-game money, but you can get it for, like, the season pass or for the crew credits, which, if, you, if you've got some, I'm not sure exactly how much it costs, but you get some at the start of the game, so that can go towards it. So that would be pretty cool. If you still got them, I spent mine on, on uh, perks straight away, but... Oh my god, this thing feels great. So I'm in sport at the moment. That's normally what I play on. So let's give these challenge a go and see how we do. Is this the top gear? I don't know if there's seven. There is! There's seven gears! There is! I did not know this. We're still on the road, shush. First person! Oh, the handling is fantastic, though. Like, you'd think it would be kind of a heavy handful. I mean, it doesn't feel as light as a lot of cars. But I remember the rule of the fact that on the crew, when you drive a heavy car, it usually handles better. We got a gold. Did we actually get a part? No, we got a level 8 part. Stop you. I've been looking for a perf car for quite some time, quite honestly. Like, I'm always driving my Skyline, and as much as I love the Skyline, I want to have something else available to me, because obviously I don't want to keep using the Skyline for everything, because the Skyline is like the maxed out car in every class for me, and I just don't want to keep using it in every class. The SLS is all nice and stuff, but it just doesn't feel right. It just sways a lot. This! 
This is an, an American car and it's, it's listening to what I want it to do. It's incredible. We found two amazing packs on each game and the star of them is the, the American Muscle and both of them do amazing. And just to be clear, there's actually people that believe I'm, I'm taking that seriously and don't know that these cars can actually turn. I'm, I'm kidding. It's a joke. Jesus Christ. Can't believe I have to say that. What are you, Ted? Move it, ambulance. My guy is, like, blocking the ambulance. You're not gonna... Okay, he's despawned. That's one way to get out of the way of the ambulance. But anyway, so as I was saying earlier, I think this is going to be the car that I use for PvP. It's just... It suits me so much. It's the perfect car for PvP in Perth. I'm pretty sure a lot of people are going to be using it in PvP, though, because a lot of people that still play the game probably have the season pass or will buy this car. Um, but I, I definitely, like, if you are looking for a controllable muscle car in Perth, you're looking at it right here. No, not me, the, the car. Oh, yes, platinum is mine. Stability is mine. What do we got? Oh, yes. I absolutely love this car. If you do, you know, if you don't have this and you're looking for one DLC car to get, I would literally say this is the one. I'm not even joking to you right now. This is actually, actually incredible. It just feels perfect. I'm swaying it and it's just, it's taking it. Taking it like a beast. Anyway, until next time, guys, before I kill it, I'll see you soon. Break, please. Peace.